cashmere in pink or dark berry hues. Wild patterns. That's Alude's cozy and elegant vision for the upcoming fall winter season. The German fashion label based in Munich made its debut at Paris Fashion Week on Wednesday. It's a milestone for head designer Andrea Karg. Getting into the official schedule of shows in Paris is a coveted privilege. Only two German labels are here at all. And Alude is the first cashmere label ever to be included in the show calendar. I've never felt like this before. You can't compare it to anything else. Andrea Karg and her team spent four months preparing for the show. In the 36-hour countdown to the start, everything needs to come together. The makeup is tested, the seating plan discussed, models cast, and the runway look finalized. The label, founded in 1993, has a strong following in France. French journalists persuaded Cog to apply for a spot in Paris's official schedule of shows. Cog is aware of her newcomer status, but still hopes to pull in the crowds. We'd like to see all the best and most important people in our audience, but we're realistic. We're here for the first time and have to earn our laurels. Nobody has been waiting for us. We have to prove ourselves. And we're confident we will. 26 models were chosen for the show in Paris. In recent years, Alude has showcased its collections at Berlin Fashion Week. But Karg says Paris is a whole different league. The professional level of the girls here is very high. The pret a porter shows in particular draw the best models from all over the world. And the choice of top-class girls is incomparably greater than in Berlin. Later in the evening, Karg checks out Paris's Grand Palais. Built in 1900 for the World's Fair, it's a regular venue for Paris Fashion Week. This week, the events here included a big Chanel show. And now, a lewd next door on a smaller scale. Nonetheless, the Paris show is a six-digit investment for the German company. Of course, everything here is more expensive, overall. How much? The models alone are more expensive, as is the location. I mean, renting the Grand Palais and this gallery is another factor. But Paris is the capital of fashion. The next morning is the day of the show. After a short night, Alude's team of 70 is busy backstage in the Grand Palais. Clothes are quickly donned. There is a short catwalk rehearsal. Meanwhile, guests are gathering outside the Grand Palais, waiting to be let in. 450 photographers, fashion buyers, and editors have showed up. Paris Fashion Week is hugely important for any fashion label, as editor-in-chief of German Vogue Christiane Arp knows. I think you achieve something different here from what's possible at the moment at Berlin's Fashion Week. Remember, all the big buyers are here, and ultimately they decide whether a collection thrives. Here you reach an international audience. And what do her colleagues from international publications say about the German label's debut? French people, it's always a pleasure to have like different market to come in our country and in Paris, you know, because of fashion, we always need like to have more inspiration around us. So yes, it's a good thing, definitely. Just a few more seconds before Karg's show gets underway. Would she like to be at Paris Fashion Week every year? Of course. She can breathe a sigh of relief. Alude has passed the test at the world's most important fashion event.